Okay, this is the second of our Faith Lift. Uh, just a little devotional thought each week. And uh, this week we, we're going to be thinking about perhaps uh, the best known passage of scripture in the Old Testament, certainly maybe in the whole of the Bible, the 23rd Psalm. And I, I want to talk to you about the significance of a word that we often miss. Uh, we are told in that psalm that, that we'll walk through the darkest valley or the valley of the shadow of death. Uh, imagine the most frightening thing that you can. The thing that would really fear, fill you with fear, give you anxiety and make you apprehensive. Well, if you had been David and you'd been a shepherd in Israel, a dark valley would be that thing. Uh, it could contain uh, predators, wild animals, there could be robbers, there were all sorts of dangers for the sheep. And so a dark valley was a circumstance that was difficult, that fills you with fear, that causes anxiety and uh, is a source of danger. And hey, some of us are in dark valleys right now. In fact, it was so dangerous that it's sometimes translated the valley of the shadow of death. And when you're in the valley, you can kind of get fixated about it, about the danger and the anxiety and the fear. And yet, that small, significant little word that I am so glad is there, we are going to walk through the valley. We don't need to camp in it. It's not going to be a forever. A dark valley is always a temporary experience. So I'm sure if you're in a dark valley right now, it feels dark. Maybe it's filling you with fear. Maybe there is very real danger. But the promise of God's word to you today is that you will walk through the valley. That this experience, difficult as it is, is only temporary. Amen.